The next level of modes is to analyze every one individually. Each mode is a unique combination of notes, a unique formula giving each mode its, its own unique sound. You can memorize a formula for every mode, but that's a little tedious. The way I was taught is to break everything down into categories of either major or minor and relate them back to the major scale or the natural minor scale. That's what I'm going to do here. So we'll start with C major. Now we're going to do every mode using C as a tonic. We'll start with C major. So we have whole step, whole step, half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. That's all the white keys. C major, so that is its own unique sound. We're going to jump ahead. We're going to do C minor, a a aka C Aeolian natural minor. Okay, now I discussed the formula to make a minor scale, but here we're going to think modally. C has to be the sixth degree of what scale? All right, well, think backwards. C, what would what is it the sixth of? All right, that means it's a minor third below something. It's a minor third below E flat. It's the sixth degree of E flat major. E flat major is a key of three flats. So those are B flat, E flat, and A flat. We write those into our scale. We'll get C minor. I'm going to do that here. We've got E flat, A flat, B flat. Now we play our scale. And gives us that dark sound of natural minor. So let's go back. So now we have C major and C minor as sort of our starting. We're going to relate everything back to those, either as a major mode or a minor mode from those. So next we go to Dorian, C Dorian. Okay, Dorian is a second mode. That means C is the second note of what major scale? All right, it's a major second above what? Major second above B flat. It's a second mode of B flat major. B flat is the key of two flats, B flat and E flat. So I'm going to put those in here. E flat and B flat. We've now created Dorian. Play it. So notice the difference between Dorian and Aeolian is this one note. Instead of a flatted 6 here, it's a major 6 here. So Dorian, the people think of it like, oh, it's like the minor but with a major 6. It's not quite as dark sounding. Now, let's come over here. Okay, the next mode is Phrygian. Okay, C Phrygian. Phrygian is the third mode. In what scale is C the third note? All right, we'll find C. What's a major third down? A flat. So C is the third, or excuse me, C Phrygian is the third mode of A flat major. A flat major is a key of four flats. I'm going to write that in. We get a marker here. D flat, E flat, A flat, B flat. So four flats. We play that. So Phrygian. People say, well, it's like minor, but with a flatted second. So it's even darker than natural minor. Next, C Lydian. All right, that's the fourth mode. From what key, or in what key, is C the fourth note? All right, find C. What's a perfect fourth down? G. C is a fourth, or C Lydian is the fourth mode of G major. G major is the key of one sharp, that's F sharp. I'm going to put that in. F sharp. Now we play it. So people say it's like major, but with a sharp fourth. So it's even happier and more uplifting than re than than regular major. Next we have mixolydian. That means that it's the fifth mode, so C is the fifth note of what major scale? Find C, it's down a fifth, F. C makes Lydian comes from F major. F is the key of one flat, which is B flat. So we write in B flat. All right, we play C makes Lydian. So it's like major, but with a flatted seventh. It's just a little hint of darkness 
in an otherwise major scale. We did Aeolian already, so the only one left is Locrian, all right? Locrian is the seventh mode. That means C is the seventh tone of what major scale? Well, that's easy. Just go up a half step. D flat. D flat is a key of, <coughs> excuse me, key of five flats. Write them in. Come on, Margaret. D flat. E flat. G flat. A flat. B flat. So you get this. That is very dark. All right, that's that is the darkest sounding mode. You flatted your second and you flatted your fifth. Okay, so there you go. All of the seven modes. All right, have their own unique sound with their own unique combination of notes, but it's easiest to remember them in relation to either major or minor.